I first entered the courtyard, I was blown away. I really haven't seen a castle, a person before, and not to mention such a beautiful castle as this. And I was really, my jaw was on the floor. I thought this was incredible. I love uh, hanging out in the garden out back. It's just, it's a very beautiful atmosphere. My first impression of Osnabrück was really fantastic. The first thing I saw was green everywhere, surrounded by nature, which I absolutely loved. And then I drove into the city and I started seeing uh, the beautiful buildings, the houses, and I saw that it does have uh, a much more urban community so it was just a great mix of the nature but with the city atmosphere and overall I have to say it was a very fantastic first impression. I grew up in New York, uh, that's where I received my associates and my bachelors from LaGuardia Community College and Brooklyn College respectively, uh, both in philosophy. Then I went on to receive my masters from Georgia State University in neurophilosophy. Finally, I ended up here in Osnabrück receiving my PhD while simultaneously doing research in cognitive science. I found a very different sort of New York. I found it very difficult to live in. All the buildings, the sidewalks, the cement was very gloomy. Uh, it was very expensive as opposed to here, which is just a whole different world. Uh, you have the best of both worlds in the sense where you have a very rich community, a lot of people around here, a lot of great stores, but there's also a lot of nature around, which I personally really love. And I just find myself with a smile on my face, you know, most mornings, which is a lot more than I could say coming from a big bustling city like New York. I actually didn't prepare too much. It was a little bit of a last minute decision uh, to come here, um, but everybody was very welcoming. I had a lot of help uh, to put things into place. One of the things that I find the most difficult about uh, living here in Osnabrück is dealing with German bureaucratics uh, in essence. come to Germany from other countries, I think the biggest challenge is the paperwork. So getting through the bureaucratic jungle, my job involves supporting people and doing all of the administrative tasks that they need to go through once they come here. The main aim of the service is to support scientists in such a way that they have time and energy to spend on the main reason for them being here, namely their research. Thanks to Dr. Debbie, um, she arranged a lot of official and unofficial uh, parties. We hanged out together. Uh, it's, it's very good, you know, to meet uh, uh, different people with different cultural uh, backgrounds and the different academic backgrounds. So uh, we met people from France, from America, from Uruguay, from uh, uh, Bangladesh. So many kinds of people. That is what important so that we can brainstorm each other about the ideas and the informations. Um, I did my master's in nanotechnology and my bachelor's in electronics and communication. And I had some uh, research experience in central government institutes uh, in India. So those pushed me here to do my doctoral study. I find the library very rich because I found here books in French that I wouldn't have found in a normal libra a university library in France. So that's very cool. I came here for an internship for my master and I asked my professor for some recommendations. He, he advised me to come to Osnabrück. I find it difficult to find friends among German people outside of the professional circle. An additional very strong argument for me is that research expertise is not necessarily focused on Germany. So if you want to find the best people, 
to find an answer to a research problem, we must really hunt for them globally. We are a young university, so the interdisciplinary cooperation between departments may be a bit easier compared to universities who have very, very strong disciplinary traditions. We have programs to support international scientists. We have English-speaking staff who support scientists if they come here, help them to find their way, finding a place to live, getting around with their children. Um, and I think these are good arguments to be here with us. So come to Osnabrück.